27 Olympic News, presented by Yellow Pages, official sponsors of the Australian Olympic team. Good morning. If you've just joined us, Australia has won an absolute thriller to advance to the semi-finals of the women's basketball. Locked at 64 all at full time, the Opals rallied to down Russia in overtime and will now meet the United States in the semis. In total contrast, though, the men's hockey team is out of the gold medal race and will now play off for bronze. The Kookaburras went down 2-1 in their semi-final against Spain. Great news in the tennis with the two Woodies going into the gold medal game. In a marathon three-setter, Todd Woodbridge and Mark Woodford eventually took the match 18-16 in the third and will now meet British pair Neil Broad and Tim Henman in the final. Australian diver Jodie Rogers is distraught after missing the finals of the three-metre springboard. Needing a solid final dive, she overtwisted. The mistake saw her plummet to 15th place, with only the top 12 advancing tonight to battle it out for the medals. It's been a good day at the track for the Aussies. In the heats of the 1500 metres for women, 29-year-old Margaret Crowley, competing in her first Olympics, turned in a fantastic run to finish third in her heat with the fourth fastest time of the day. She now moves into the semi-finals. Now the story's making news here in Atlanta this morning. I'll have another update for you a little later. Stay watching for more Seven Olympic News. Brought to you by Yellow Pages, official sponsors of the Australian Olympic team.